Hey everybody, she's Ken, I'm Zan, and today we're drinking... It says Geki Kinsaki Black and Gold, 15.6% by volume. Okay. I have had it chilled. Yeah. So we'll see if it actually is any good, or if this is one that's meant to be served warm. Yeah. Yay. It appears to be an American made one. Yep, it says California. So, depending, that could already be a death sentence. <laughs> Considering they ruined one of my other ones that if you import it from Japan, it's great and it's made here. Stateside is horrible. Smells okay. Come by. Very mild. Real mild. Not a lot of flavor either way. I mean, I get a little bit that I know there's something there. But you could almost drink this like water. Yeah. Which necessarily isn't a good thing. No. Because <clears throat> it just has that tint that you'd ex a flavor you'd expect from like a, little, a sake. Very light though. Very light, but I can feel it like on my tongue and the base of my like the like the flavor sits on the base of my tongue, but it's so light. That it's almost like it's not there. Like, I know it's there, but it's almost like it's not there. Yeah. You could literally be a good drink to mix with. Of course, you're not got, you don't got high alcohol proof anyway. I mean, give me some more because I need another round. It's just... It's so light. So subtle. Yeah. Very, very light. I mean, I've had some... Some sakis where... I can't get over the first taste because it's like punch you in yeah, the, the mouth. Yeah. And the aromas not really present either, not much. It's got a subtle subtle aroma. Like it's got a subtle aroma where you know it's sake, but when you go to drink it, very, very subtle taste. Yeah, but not not a subtle that I enjoy. Because like, it doesn't I, have much flavor. Like you said, it's like drinking water. Yeah. But I mean, if you're not used to sake, man, I, I could drink this. Everybody could drink that. <laughs> I could drink this. There's not I've a person had, alive had, that couldn't drink that. I've had sakis where because, not necessarily, that it smelled good, but then it would hit my tongue and I'd be like, oh, hell no. This has none of that. <laughs> No, I mean, but it doesn't have much because of anything. Because it doesn't have much of anything to begin with, but... Yeah, it's virtually, like I said, that it's a palate cleanser. <laughs> a palate cleanser is hockey. <laughs> yeah, exactly. It's almost like a palate cl cleanser ice cream in between courses. A palate cleanser is hockey between drinks. Yeah, I mean... I said it's not bad if you want to introduce someone to a sake... They can maybe get a hint of it, but it's not. Out of all the different yeah. brands I've tried, is that's a new experience where it's like almost flavorless. Yeah, like I said, I can I can smell I can smell it. I can slightly taste it, but it's not one where I have to sip down. I could probably, relatively speaking, probably chuck chug it down i wouldn't want to but no you you could this would be just like chugging a bottle of water on a hot day a little really is. slight well alcoholic and slight bit of of flavor type thing lingering on your tongue yeah i mean at 15 percent proof it's like a strong wine or almost to a point of a port mm. it says It's almost like, to me, I'm wondering if they diluted it too much. 
It's an interesting one. It's definitely interesting because I kind of go back and forth where I half like it, but I half don't. I don't know kind of... At least it doesn't say really any particular type other than just black and gold. So it's like, what exactly were they trying to go for? Well, you said it was a Genki, Genki Kai? Genki Kinsaki, yeah. Genki Kinsaki. And we've had that one before where the American ones... That's the song about that, earlier. The with, American with, one is horrible. With this, with this, yeah, with this one where you had the tiny imported from Japan one, great! The larger made in America one... Not so great. Same brand. Same brand. Different model. Well, something gets lost in the process, and I'm wor wondering if it's the same thing's happened here. <laughs> um, so on that note, if you're looking for an easy drink to drink, get you some of this. Uh, it's probably about the same as Jack Daniels, really. Yeah. Crown. But so if you want to be introduced to sake, you don't want. <sighs> I mean, it's it's kind of one of those where it's sake, but it's not sake. So if you want to try it and then work your way up to the actual sake. Yeah, I mean. Even though it's labeled as sake. Yeah, because like the other good brand sakis, they're so rich in flavor and easy to drink. Go down smooth. Yeah. This one, go, this one it's go smooth, down smooth. But I just, it's not the flavor I want. Mm. So it's, it's disappointing on that note. It's nice that it's not one of the ones that you, it's you not can't harsh. drink it. It's not harsh. It's not one that's like some less quality sakis where if it's you have to drink it heated because you can't drink it cold. Yeah. You could definitely drink this cold. Yeah. Uh, so on that surprising bombshell, um, later, perhaps. <laughs>